Hello, everybody. Welcome to another part of the Eric Show. Well, it's been a while since I recorded anything. I know I've been singing stuff on here. I've been watching a lot of uh, YouTube videos, Dave's Farm, and a couple others you'll see on my favorites and everything. Yes, I'm an Elvis fan, but there's other thing, other music I like, country, rock and roll, oldies, and stuff like that, my dumb. There's a few things, like Peter Griffin would say, that grinds my gears. Things are, when you go and watch a video on YouTube, you go, you go to watch, like, let's say you go to watch something about Triple H on WWE, and somebody puts a stupid music on, well, what is it? I can't remember the song because I haven't been hit with it yet recently. But I don't understand why people go and do that and just waste their time doing it. I mean, that's just stupid. Why waste your time making something that you're just going to get rude comments from? I mean, why be the bad guy? You could be the good guy and make great videos and, heck, get a lot of views. I know I don't get many views because, really, I guess I'm not that great at doing this thing. I mean, I haven't done this very much anyway, but uh, I still like to tell everybody the sites that I gave you on my other show it's uh, singsnap.com and myyearbook.com them are great sites to go to singsnap if you go to singsnap look for uh, look for me I'm called the viper it's the underscore viper underscore 2008 and look for that that is me and uh, well just leaving me a comment if you enjoyed the site if you didn't well I'm sorry I mean I tried to give you a good site MySpace also got karaoke but I find SingSnap to be more you know of a better site I mean you got more to choose from it probably don't got all the songs you want but at least you can try some that you do like if they got them but on my yearbook it's better than MySpace because you get to bid on pictures and everything and uh, you can really do stuff on there more than you can do on MySpace. I probably haven't messed with MySpace enough to even try to do anything but I really like my yearbook. My <clears throat> ex-girlfriend got me started in it and uh, well, I, I'm addicted to yearbook so I guess I'm never going to leave it but uh, I'm also uh, got a yearbook name but I don't know if you can find it but uh, if you would like to hit me up just hit me up on the yearbook or anything I should or not yearbook but sing snap go there find me and leave me a message I'll put you on my yearbook but um, anyway I don't know if y'all seen uh, Resident Evil Extinction that's a pretty good movie. I was wondering if they were going to come out with another one because the way it ended, it kind of made you think that. I hate when they do that because it makes you think they're going to put out another one and then then you hear that they're not going to do it. But uh, I'd like to ask everybody out there about Grand Theft Auto for your PC. I'd like to know how I could get the cheats on putting the cars in there, you know, Christine and uh, General Lee and everything like that. If y'all could please post the comments at the bottom and leave me a message on how to uh, get the cheats, I'd appreciate it. I've been looking for those. I've, I've went to sites trying to find them and they just give me complicated stuff I have to go through. I'm not a computer genius. <laughs> though I know a little bit about this computer since it's at HP and it crashes nearly all the time. Uh, I tell you, I hate HP. I've dealt with Dells because my brother had one. It was sort of better than this one. But I guess I just need one of them ones that you just can customize, you know, put all the stuff you need in there. But uh, anyway, I'm going to cut this show short. I hope you all enjoyed everything. And enjoy watching. If you can, please leave a few comments down below if you enjoyed the show. Thank you very much.